This week, a pilot writes, I performed an engine run on day two of my rigged 19.5 trip per pay pairing. Looking at my payroll report after the trip was audited, it appears the 1.0 trip for pay for the engine run was absorbed by the rig. I was under the impression that engine runs were in addition to the rig. Is my pay correct? Well, to answer, unfortunately, in this case, the final pay is correct, as the additional pay for the engine run was absorbed by the trip rig for the three-day pairing. For Section 4BB, you earn one trip for pay extra for an engine run in addition to the pay for that day. Since the original pay for day two was 6.28 trips for pay, the pay for that day increases to 7.28 with the addition of the engine run pay. However, the individual days combined to include the extra pay on day two still only total 19.24 trips for pay, which is lower than the contractually rigged 19.5 guaranteed for a three-day pairing. You were paid correctly for the higher of the two values. If this were a turn, the pay would be calculated a little differently. Pursuant to a previous grievance resolution, any engine run conducted on a single day pairing will pay an additional 1.0 trip for pay above any rigs. Since we believe pilots should be properly compensated for this additional duty, we have proposed changes in contract 2020 to ensure engine runs and repositions are never absorbed by any rig. For more information on enhancements like this that we are seeking in contract negotiations, please see the February and April 2019 issues of the Negotiating Point on Swapa.org, as well as the SRC blog, Blueprint for Success. As always, if you have any contract-related questions, please give us a call or send us an email.